All right, YouTube, it is Mr. Mean coming at you this Tuesday evening. I almost forgot what day it was. Uh, just a quick video to uh, give a shout out to uh, Wiki Snapper and Goblin Scribe and Steve G over uh, the, some of the fine folks involved with Low Fantasy Gaming. Uh, I did a interview today with the Dave, aka Wiki Snapper. Uh, with his trade wins book and it was quite well received and it was awesome to see that and then of course wiki snapper went and i guess had all of his, his friends and his immediate family members go and sign up on my youtube channel so i think we're up to 992 subscribers so i think we're about eight away from a thousand subscribers so it'd be awesome if we can push it over the limit and hit that thousand um for those that don't know, for YouTube's algorithms and everything, they do a combined total of a minimum of 1,000 subscribers in X amount of hours. And I think it's, I want to say it's either 4,000 or 5,000 watched hours. Well, I'm well over that. Um, but uh, uh, I, I need 1,000 subscribers to be monetized. And what that means is the monetization means that uh, YouTube will put commercials and stuff and ads in the videos, which sucks. But um, when you click on them, and people do click on them, believe it or not, um, and also by how much time is spent, YouTube kicks you back a little money. Um, and I don't know all the particulars and ins and outs of it, but uh, it's just a little way to uh, help support my family. And, you know, obviously I can't do it without you guys, so I appreciate it. A lot of people have been using the... Um, uh, affiliate code for drive through RPG so I really want to thank everybody for doing that as well because that is awesome there's a couple of things I want to do for the channel of course I also have my patreon uh, which is five dollars a month I have no intentions of raising it anytime soon uh, I think five dollars is good value for what you get because let's face it you're just watching me talk and maybe once in a while if you're if you're a subscriber and or a patreon uh, you get first if you're a patreon you get first dibs on uh, any games that I run uh, any uh, things I do like I have an ongoing uh, thing where I go that game uh, which is where I'll get a, f a couple of the patrons and maybe a, a person in the gaming industry of some kind way shape or form and uh, we'll sit around for an hour or two and we'll talk about uh, games that we enjoy or games that don't get enough love or have influenced us in some way shape or form so I'm getting ready to fire that up again it took a little hiatus at the end of the year uh, vacations and stuff and you know the this time of the season it's just hard to get people together and I like to get about three people plus me, so I like to get that together and have everybody chit-chat about that. So we'll be resurrecting that probably late January, early February. Um, I'm also going to be doing a Patreon giveaway, uh, which is I go through my library and I get a couple of things and I put them in a box and I send them to one lucky subscriber. Uh, totally at my cost, doesn't cost you anything. The only thing it costs you is your $5 a month membership. And it's just a little way for me to give back. I'm actually going to actually try to reach out to some of the publishers on the channel and see if they'd be willing to uh, give me uh, some some drive through RPG codes that I could give out for various projects. So if you're one of said publishers that's watching this and you want to do that, feel free to email me. I'll put links down in the doobly-doo down below. Uh, it's uh, Mr. Mean Speaks at gmail.com is my channel email. Um, so, and of course, you can always reach me on Discord. And of course, as a Patreon, you get a special designator uh, that shows that you are a Patreon member uh, on Discord. Uh, and of course, that gets you into obviously uh, first choice for games and stuff like that when I when I run them. Uh, my VTT virtual tabletop of choice is Foundry. Um, I do enjoy it. I do host through the Forge, which just takes all the weight off of my computer as far as disseminating all the stuff and bringing all the links in together and i've used it for pathfinder i've used it for low fantasy gaming i've used it for cypher as a player um, i've had no issues with it. it works great so foundry is pretty awesome it is my vtt of choice uh what else is going on uh well it's a sad day in the world of mr mean i broke down and i rejoined facebook 
um, but I did not reopen my personal account. I created an all new account uh, for Mr. Mean Speaks. So if you just go to Facebook and you type in Mr. Mean Speaks, you should be able to find me. Uh, I'll put a link down in the doobly doo. I've also put it on my Discord and, and everything like that. So I'll make sure to update all that information accordingly. And I'll make sure that if going forward in my videos that there is a Facebook link. Um, I'm not a huge fan of Facebook. Um, I don't like its political outlook and its monetization and everything, but so many people are on Facebook. And MeWe, I'm, MeWe is my social media of choice. And what makes MeWe great, um, and of course, if you don't know about MeWe, there's a link down in the doobly-doo. Uh, MeWe, you only see what you want to see, and there's no ads ever. They, they say they will never do ads. They do have a subscription service. Um, it's not terribly expensive. I do not subscribe because I don't do enough on MeWe. I basically use MeWe as a social media hub to distribute my videos to groups that are, you know, in the interest of the content that I create. So I don't do a lot on MeWe. I do, I do troll it quite a bit and I do look at pe what other people post, but I don't actively participate in it. And like I said, I just, I post my videos to different groups. Um, and I think I would say probably all of the groups have given me permission to post. Uh, so it's it's pretty awesome in that aspect. Um, and again, MeWe, you only see what you're interested in. So you go in, you create a profile, uh, and MeWe's not paying me to say any of this. This is just uh, the reason I left Facebook years ago and went to MeWe was just because MeWe is dedicated to no ads, no no spam, no porn, all that stuff. You don't see any of that. And the nice part is um, it's basically like Facebook closed groups. Only people can get in that you let in, which is nice. Um, so I have a number of uh, uh, friends on there and stuff. And so it's pretty cool. I did. We went bowling Saturday and we went to dinner. And so I posted pictures of that. And I was surprised how many people uh, clicked, you know, liked or put a funny emoji or whatever. So that was kind of nice. So do I miss the the social media uh, aspect? No, I don't. It's not my cup of tea, but it's a market out there that could get me more subscribers, get me more advertisement, get me more uh, product reviews, uh, and get my opinions and my videos out there into the wild. So if that helps me out, like the MeWe Pathfinder group, I think has about 8,000 members in it. At least the one I'm in has about 8,000 members. The Facebook uh, Pathfinder 2nd Edition group that I just asked to join has 85,000 members in it. 85,000 members. So if I post a Pathfinder 2E video, that's potentially 85,000 likes, you know, and, and who knows how many subs that I could get. So obviously it's, it's important to diversify and get that stuff posted. So I just wanted to do a little public service announcement. I've already, like I said, I've updated my discord, I put a note on the main, uh, let's talk about games. It doesn't mean that I'm shilling away for Facebook. Um, but it is a viable platform and I need to recognize that. And if I want to grow my brand and I want to stretch out and, and just make a go of this YouTube thing, um, that's what I need to do. Um, and so that's what I have done. And uh, so far, I just I just did it 10 minutes ago, and I sent out a couple links. Uh, as a matter of fact, I posted, started posting a bunch of my videos going through the backlog of my, um, for those that don't know, on my Discord page, whenever I create a new video, um, I put a link on my Discord page. And so I was able to just cut and paste that link out of Discord and put it up on Facebook. Facebook and after I don't know about the seventh or eighth, maybe the tenth one, Facebook's like, Whoa, hold up, partner, you're you've exceeded the limit of post in, in a certain amount of time, so slow down. So I'll I'll just go up and as I have time I'll I'll post a couple of more. But um I definitely want to interact with the Facebook group. Um, you know, so if you know MeWe's not your thing and Facebook is infinitely bigger than MeWe, then you know, that's totally a way to, you know, chat with me and stuff like that. So I'll be more than happy to use it. I'm going to install it on my phone uh, so that I have Facebook on my phone, and I'll be posting my videos to Facebook uh, when I when I do them on YouTube as well as MeWe and as well as Discord and and all the groups in MeWe. So it's it's just another avenue for Mr. Mean to uh, to get my brand out there and uh, you know go from there. And you know with the larger subscription base. Um, it makes me a little more viable for merchandise and things like that. So I, I'd like to eventually get my logo on a t-shirt, which brings me to my next point of note 
if you are an artist and you want to get yourself out there, please reach out to me, Mr. Mean Speaks at gmail.com. Feel free to play around with my ch channel logo, um, a character of this. If you are so brave, I, I pity you. But uh, yeah, um, you know, if you want to make uh, design a new logo or design something, I'd like something that could go on a t shirt and maybe some mouse pads and some coffee cups. So, or water bottles or whatever. So, uh, that, and you know, of course, I'm willing to compensate you for your work. So, let me know if that's something that interests you. If you have that artistic talent or that digital talent and you can do stuff like that, let me know. I would love to do it because I want to get some t shirts made. Um, and I definitely want to uh, expand the logo. I, I love the logo that was made for me. The gentleman who made it. Um, has kind of disappeared from social media. I, 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 he's not on Discord anymore. I can't seem to contact him. Uh, so I hope all is well. Um, and he made it out of the goodness of his heart because I had mentioned that I wanted a logo and he just whipped it up. And I think it's an awesome logo and I really, really like it. Um, it's on my Dice Tower um, that I had made from Draco Dr Drené uh, on Etsy um, as well as my GM screen and I'm getting a dice box a dice jail just because I was rolling horrible the other night and so I was like this die needs to go into the dice jail so I didn't have a dice jail so it was under 20 bucks so I, I, I commissioned him to make one for me so anyway um, just a quick video um, just riding high off of today's interview with Wiki and, and the love and everything that you guys went out there and showed it tons of comments and you know I try to reply to every comment um, I will go live on Facebook as well uh, a little bit down the road uh, that might actually be where I will do the uh, that game um, so that I can appeal to a wider audience of people um, Mr. Mean Speaks is still a very small brand, um, you know, and, and a lot of people don't know about it. But, you know, with your guys' help, tweet it out, you know, hit, put it on your Facebook page or MeWe page, whatever. Let's grow the meanie army. Uh, let's get the horde into the size of a horde. We're sitting at about um, about 150 Discord users. I would say about 120 of those are active uh, I go through the list every so often. I don't want to kick anybody just because they haven't posted. I know a lot of people just join and then they fall off the wayside. But uh, we want to run some more games on Foundry. Uh, if you're a GM and you want a place to run, uh, you're more than welcome to do it on Mr. Mean Speaks uh, Discord. Um, that's part of what it's there for. I just ask that you uh, you give me the courtesy of letting me know. And uh, hopefully it's something I can play and we can sit there and, and I can play as well. But I don't always need to be. Um, it's a place for gamers and the chat room is open. You know, the House of Mean is the audio chat that I've created um, and that is where you guys can you can join in the discord and you can go in there and chit chat with people as you so desire There's a lot of publishers on my discord uh, indie publishers. So that's pretty cool and yeah um, Pretty excited um, We do a lot of you know Kickstarter reviews not Kickstarter reviews But games that may possibly have come off of Kickstarter or are going to Kickstarter So if you're part of that crowd and you know of a Kickstarter that looks interesting Feel free to post a link on Mr. Mean Speaks. Uh, it, uh, let's talk about RPGs because uh, I'd love to look at it and review it and uh, and or reach out to the company and, uh, you know, do something like that. So um, other than that, I think that's really all I wanted to say. I just wanted to put out a big shout out to, uh, like I said, a huge thank you to Wiki Snapper and his crew for just really pumping up the channel and them being so nice and the, the, the love that was given back the interview was a lot of fun if you haven't watched it yet you know it, it's on the channel go check it out it's out actually on my facebook channel as well which i will put a link to my facebook channel in the doobly-doo so as always peace love and hair grease just a quick video this tuesday night to tell everybody what's going on and that i've i have come to the dark side i've joined the ranks of facebook pray for my soul as always guys peace love and hair grease and remember Mr. Mean says be nice. Take care, everybody.